Hello everyone, my name is Brian Reyes, and welcome to another Daily Devotion. Now today we're on day 110, and the title of the day is called Infected. The verse of the day is in James chapter 3, verses 5 through 6. It only takes a spark, remember, to set off a forest fire. A careless or wrongly placed word out of your mouth can do that. By our speech, we can ruin the world, turn harmony to chaos, throw mud on a reputation, send the whole world up in smoke and go up in smoke with it. Smoke right from the pit of hell. Are you a germaphobe, meaning a fear of germs? Do you always wash your hands before you eat? Do you always carry a hand sanitizer with you at all times? Do you not trust the five second rule? Not a psychological fear of them, but just a hatred of them. But maybe you should hate them. Experts estimate about 60,000 types of germs. Sure, we encounter germs every day, but they're not all that deadly. But still, researchers found that 70 through 80 percent of grocery carts that have been tested in the U.S. have a thing called E. coli, which is a bacteria that causes diarrhea, vomiting, and stomach cramps. Even your desks have 400 times more germs than a toilet. A toilet! Crazy, isn't it? But germs aren't the only infectious little things around here. How we use words to hurt someone can be as dangerous as germs. It says on James chapter 3 verses 7 through 8 that all kinds of animals can be tamed, but the tongue can't be. On verse 9, it says that we use the same tongue to praise God and to curse. It's like if you sneeze in your mouth. When you give a high five to the person next to you, that person will get infected. This is the same thing as saying hurtful words to another. What we need to do is ask the Holy Spirit to purify us with nice and helpful words. Now those kinds of word germs would be worth catching, wouldn't it? This has been another Daily Devotional. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next week. Goodbye.